I'm already here. That thing can talk. Incredible. Yeah, yeah. Didn't you hear? It's me, Burke. Where'd you dig up that bag of bones? How much do you want for it? Well, let's keep searching. He's not gonna have that magic formula. Hey, tell your new friend he should eat something, yeah? He's all skin and bones, without the skin. <laughs> can you sell me something? Of course I can sell you something. But you must do something for me first. I want you to find the World Devourer and bring me its heart. I need 300 boulders of destruction from the Volcano of Death. I also want you to haul up the cursed treasure of Captain Bloodblade from the deepest part of the ocean. Lastly, I would like a dragon's eye. Anything else? <laughs> Only kidding. These are just stories from old times. Maybe there's no such thing as a world devourer. And Captain Bloodblade's treasure is probably just a legend too. Hey, I'm a businessman. Of course I'll sell you my goods. Connor wants 300 gold for the magic formula. Just go to my body and take the gold out the bag. Berg? Berg. Damn. Am I really that dumb? Here's the gold for the formula. Thank you. Here. Take it. Here's your incantation. If I speak the incantation and don't return to my body, finish it off. I'm sure nothing will happen to you. Well, he goes. Imatora morte opatere. Ha! I finally have my body back. I never would have managed that without you. You deserve a boatload of gold for that. Do you miss your skeleton form? Not at all. I tell you, there are no advantages to being a skeleton. Drinking's no fun and a good steak just goes right through you. Well, the ladies weren't exactly lining up to stroke my bones, if you know what I mean. Welcome to the lowest level of hell. Gallows humor's the only thing that helps with all the shit going on here. Spoken like a great warrior! Or someone who thinks he's one. Oh yeah. Well, you look like you've seen better days yourself. That's a long fucking journey you're asking me to do. I'll make sure you won't go away empty-handed. I'm talking about a unique grindstone. A diamond grinder. All right. I'll bring Grace your engagement ring. Man, speak a little more softly. I don't want to become the butt of everyone's jokes. Come on. Are you a man or a mouse? Here's the ring. And now get the hell out of here. We should get a move on, or this old toy boy here might get pissed off! <laughs> Usually old Vito gives me a hand. If only I knew where he is. I send him out to get some iron, and he disappears. He better not be with that whore he vet in Travis's tavern again. We don't have time for women. That's rich coming from you. Yeah, go on, make your stupid jokes. All right, I will find Alvito for you. Boom, motherfuckers. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Quite a thing to say. Well, I wish they were just empty words. But unfortunately, this is our fate. Welcome to Calador, the last bastion of the dark warriors this side of the great stream of lava. As long as the war of the Titan Lords continues, we will need every strong man we can get. Our task here is to defend the people against the forces of darkness. I want to become an even better warrior. 
You wish to become stronger when confronting the shadows? I can teach you a few things that every warrior should know. However, I won't teach you any magic as long as you're not one of the demon hunters. The secret knowledge of the dark warriors is well protected. However, if you want to learn how to fight, you should speak to Henrik or Drake. What can you teach me? What would you like to know? I want to make my own potions. It's probably best if you stick closely to the recipe to start with. Combine the ingredients and heat the mixture. Not all potions need to be heated. Well, just stick to the recipe. That isn't too difficult. The Shadow Lord stole my spirit. Yes, I suspected as much. I can see it in your eyes. That's not good. I could think of better situations. How did that happen? Let's keep it short. I got too close to a crystal portal while in a skull cave on the Crab Coast. These skull caves have appeared all over the Southern Seas. I've heard innumerable reports of people being hunted and killed by shadows. Often, their souls are removed in order to make them compliant. Your strong will alone is the reason you're still in command of your wits. Most have become minions of the underworld. You have come far. Impressive. Tragic that it will all be for nothing. <laughs> I don't want to join the Underworld. Help me get my spirit back. It's not that simple, lad. The Underworld is full of mysteries and illusions. One moment everything seems clear, and the next... It's all shrouded in a veil of oblivion. But you must be able to do something. The old culture of Kalador was highly developed and may contain the knowledge we'll need. Have you any idea who is behind these attacks by the Shadows? It must be an ancient power from times long past. Our opponent has not yet revealed himself. But I'm afraid that when he does, it will be fatal. A ghost named Crow is terrorizing the seas. The enemy should never be allowed to gain control of the seas. If that happens, we will all be finished. None of us will be able to count on other factions for help. What's a druid got to do with demon hunters? Don't let yourself be blinded by the dust of the crumbling ruins. Even today, this land still conceals a great power. In its heyday, the dark warriors of Kalador still understood the relevance of the Titan Wars. They were aware of the weak points of their masters, the Titan Lords. The offspring of these warriors of yore still possess that ability to this day. I lit the green fire and watched them making pilgrimages to the land of their ancestors in search of their destiny. I'm here to help them remember their old strength. Now that the shadows have come over the land, we need them more than ever. Can the knowledge of Kalidor help me? Real treasures are still hidden. The Dark Warriors were wise. The ancient knowledge they collected has for the most part remained untouched in the ruins. If you can find these writings and bring them to me, I may be able to help you get your spirit back. I've brought you ancient knowledge from Kalador. 
Where should I start looking? The demon hunter's old records refer to a grimoire. A text from a time when their culture still flourished. Its last known whereabouts is said to be an old castle ruin to the west of Iron Bay. Castle ruin in the west. Find grimoire. Shouldn't be a problem. Good. But be on your guard. The reports from the area are disconcerting. One of the Shadow Lords fled to the west after our last battle. I'm sure he's still there somewhere. I'll bear that in mind. What can you tell me about the big ship down in the Iron Bay? I think it's probably their last chance to leave the country when Kalador falls. The Dark Warriors will stay anchored there until Kalador is liberated. Unless someone goes to them and shows them how they could contribute with their frigate. But they will only listen to a demon hunter. How can I help you? We fought our last battle in the north. My dark warriors smoked out the skull caves and the crystal portal was destroyed. But we suffered heavy losses. Many were killed and many fled. They have not returned since then. They need help in finding their way back to the Citadel. You can count on me. I'll take care of your warriors. Thank you. As I said, we can use all the help we can get. You destroyed a crystal portal. How? I found the spell here in the Citadel. It's easy if you know how it's done. The spell makes the crystal resonate until it shatters into a thousand shards. Come, I'll show you. I'll show you how to cast a magic spell. Pay close attention. It's your turn. I'll give it a go. Very good. Now you should also be able to destroy a crystal portal. Thanks. I look forward to smashing those animals straight back to the underworld. Can I be a demon hunter? Yes. I can teach you the ancient magics of the Dark Warriors. When they are all gathered in the Citadel, we will renew the ancient covenant with a ceremonial rite. There, you may be accepted by the demon hunters. I see.
I've never seen such strong arms. Spend some time with me and buy me a drink. Sure. I'll buy you some rum. <laughs> Ladies don't drink rum. Why don't you give me 30 gold and I'll buy myself something suitable later? No problem. Here's the gold. A true gentleman among all these louts. Admirable. Most of the guys here don't know how to treat a lady. I'm lucky. My porter isn't like them. So, porter's the one who's feeling generous. Yes, he always gives me nice things. New boots, a pretty dress, flowers. Oh, I just love him. He even gave me a precious amulet recently. About the amulet. I'm not good enough at this. I'm really not that good. I'll buy it from you. It's not for sale. Even if it was, I doubt you have enough gold. Really? How much? Five hundred gold? Five hundred? I don't need you to take the piss out of me. I'm sure you don't. Come on. It's not worth that much. Hmm, all right. Three hundred. I won't sell it for any less. Take it or leave it. Do you have any idea where the blacksmith's apprentice Alvito could be? Alvito? Hmm. A young lad. One of the demon hunters. And assistant to that Wilson. That's him? I don't know him. What? But you just said... Well, do you think you're getting anything from me for free? I gave you 30 gold coins. Now speak. All right, but my services don't usually come this cheap. Yeah, right. Alvito told me that he was going to the old iron mine northwest of here. You can't miss it. Just follow the rise north of the tavern. Vague promises do not constitute a spellbook in scientific terms. It has the power to manipulate humans. Today, it is kept by the Guild of Mages on Tyrannus. Very interesting.
You'd better not touch anything. Bastards trying to steal us, too! Better go. You'd better not. What is it? Just taking a look around. Go ahead. There will be no meat left by the time you're done, and I'll have to work even harder. But don't think you can fool me. Are you guarding this farm? Do I look like a guard? My job is to feed the pigs. And once I'm done with that, I have to shovel away the shit that they produce. This life sucks. The cycle of life. Fascinating. Oh, really? I'd be happy to swap places. Ah, uh, no. I think you're in good hands here. I take it you don't care too much for strangers. No, I don't. Why should I? They hardly have two pennies to rub together, and if they have, they've not been earned through honest labor. Nah, keep me away from the whole lot of them. No stranger has robbed you. Huh, it's easy for you to talk. You have to... Wait a moment. Are you trying to rob me? Um, me? If that's what you've got in mind, forget it. You're not taking me for a ride that easily. So if you have no more questions, I have a lot to do. Surely Sir recognizes a bargain when he sees it. I have a wonderful pig here. And if it ends up on your plate, oh my, will your mouth water. That sounds good. Splendid! That'll be 250 gold. Good. I'll take the pig for that price. Ah, but looking at you, I doubt you'll know what to do with it. Listen, let me slaughter it for you, and then you'll get 20 meat bundles as provisions. But the cost will be 400 gold for everything. That's a decent price. I'm not good enough at this.
I'll get back to you. You don't have enough gold? Come back when you do. You surely won't want to miss out on such a fantastic offer. Teach me something. What would you like to know? How's the pig breeding going? It's tough, but it's honest work. Hasn't got any easier since the shadows moved into Iron Bay. But they're gonna have to deal with me before I give up even one pig. Do you have much to do with the other farms? Not much. Although the demon hunters bring me news when they come to buy meat. I'd prefer to do without that kind of news, though. Don't hear nothing but trouble from out there.
Ah, that was tough. That really wasn't necessary. You're leaving. I'm out of here. What are you doing here? I'd advise you to leave, and quickly. Why should I? The shadows are rising out of the ground. There are reports of dead people everywhere. Green fires are burning. Suddenly, these damn demon hunters appeared and took over the old citadel. And you're asking why? How does it help you if I leave? I'll have fewer mouths to feed. We fishermen are responsible for most of the provisions around here. Since the shadows started threatening the world, it's harder to survive on Kalidor. Hard, but not impossible. That's a reason to hope, huh? I... I don't think I follow. It's alright. Just ignore what he said. Tell me more about the threat. What do you want to know? What was all that about the demon hunters? Most new recruits are joining them. There isn't much choice of what you can be here on Kalidor. Demon hunter or grave digger. Well, I forgot to mention becoming a corpse. What did you say about the green fires? The demon hunters also appeared here after the green fires were lit. I'm not sure if that's a good thing or not. Why not? They could protect you from the shadows. They could, yes. But they don't. All they do is eat our fish. Tell me more about the green fires. They suddenly started burning. I've heard rumors they're supposed to be some sort of a call. But if you want to know who ignited them, I have no idea. What about the Citadel? The Citadel is a grim old ruin where the demon hunters have established their base. I advise you not to go there. The road is perilous. The best thing to do is leave the island the same way you came. What are you doing here? When I'm not fishing, I'm advising all the new arrivals on this island to turn around and leave immediately. I'm not planning on leaving again. I figured you'd say something like that. Then let me take you to our fishing village at least. Just so you don't wind up wandering around Kalidor until some shadow makes you his breakfast. The fishing village sounds good. Good choice. Let me know if I can show you the way. Take me to the fishing village. Follow me. Here we are. Have a look around, but you won't find much here. If you're planning to go deeper into the wilderness, remember to stock up with provisions. Apart from that, I do knife throwing practice every evening. Feel free to challenge me if you see me doing target practice.
I'm going to make a hat! <laughs> <laughs> Squished.
I'm going to make a hat out of your skin! Ooh, that hurt! <laughs> 